BTS Jin finally revealed the reason behind the delay in his military enlistment. But before that don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also hit the bell icon to never miss an update. This year, the news of BTS Jin's military enlistment broke not only the hearts of the armies but also the hearts of the entire world. It was also one of the topics that not only fans but also the Korean government was discussing. Jin recently hosted a live broadcast for his most recent solo release, The Astronaut. He discussed his military enlistment in this broadcast. He revealed that the plan was to enlist after the release of the album B but however, after the dynamite, they were forced to abandon their entire plan due to COVID. He said originally, the members and I had discussed plans for me to enlist soon after the B album. However, that summer, along with the wave of the COVID-19 pandemic, our song Dynamite ranked number one on Billboard's Hot 100. Because of its unexpected success, I couldn't just go off to the military right then. We were still in the middle of a pandemic, and to return the love that the fans showed us, we decided to work on Butter and Permission to Dance. These two songs also saw great results, and so it just didn't feel right for me to put everything down and leave the members and fans. After Permission to Dance two things came between Jin and his military service, the first was the Permission to Dance concert and then Grammy. He shared, after Permission to Dance, we decided that I had to participate in our concerts before I began my mandatory service. I also told the members that if I went to the army, performing on stage would be one of the things I would miss the most. So then we wrapped up our concerts successfully, but after that, we were invited to the Grammys. So then, it was okay, let's go after the Grammys. Furthermore, Jin also revealed in which month of this year he was supposed to enlist, I was supposed to enlist around May or June of this year, and the company had given me the okay. In June, we even talked about how we would wrap up our group promotions temporarily and begin solo promotions. For me, that was a roundabout way of saying that I would be bidding everyone farewell for a while due to mandatory service. But one more thing got in the way of Jin's enlistment, I had told the members that I wanted to enlist in the summer, or in the fall at the latest. But then there was the Pusan concert, and the members said, this might be one last chance for us to perform a concert together in Korea with all seven of us and also we haven't had a proper concert where we could hear our Korean fans' voices. So they convinced me to wait until the end of the Pusan concert. In his live broadcast, Jin also shared the hate he and all members received regarding military enlistment. In Korea, all of the members and I received a lot of hate for this whole ordeal. To be honest, there's a small part of me that feels upset. The only reason that we did not announce our position regarding the military service was because we did not want armies to cry at our Pusan concert. But so many people were talking about us, saying, they should receive exemption or it is their duty to serve, and the controversy was exacerbated. Even though all of that doesn't feel quite right, I'm at least glad that I didn't see our fans in tears during our concert. It was worth it to endure the criticism. So this was the video guys tell us what you think about Jin's military enlistment news. And if you liked the video don't forget to share it with your army friends also follow our social media handles, link is in the description below.